Alrighty, and I have returned, and we're gonna do some option bits. What I might end up doing, just because everything's, you know, so spaced out, I might just record small little tidbits, so you might notice, like, a sudden just skip. <clears throat> that'll just be me splicing the videos together. I think that might make doing these optional bits easier. Anyways, let's go see how old Obadiah's doing, or whatever those guys' names. Dramatic Entrance! Whoa! Pardon me, horsey. I'm sorry. It's recent actions in the vicinity. Oh, it's because I ran to his. God damn it, really? Because I ran to his horse. Okay, Missy. Okay, Missy, let's turn around. Wait for it to light up again, I guess. Hey, what? Whoa. What's the hurry? Or not. Okay, can we go see him now? Thank you. Sheesh. I assaulted his horse, now he wants nothing to do with me. What's the matter with me? What the hell are you talking about? Yeah, I thought I was gonna run into those streets for a second. Okay, John, without assaulting his horse or offending it or whatever the case. Doot 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 bitch. Ah. Hello, sir. And who might you be? A caller. John Marston. Uh, years ago, a friend of mine helped you retrieve your horse. You became friends? Oh, yeah. Arthur. Yeah. Yeah. How is he? He dead. Uh, sorry to say, he passed soon after that. Ah, oh, that's a shame. <sighs> I read about you in his journal. Been calling in on folks. Well, I'm grateful. I'm one of them. <laughs> uh, how you keeping out here? Ah, keeping fine, thank you. It's all right then, is it? <sighs> Living out here, away from civilization. <laughs> Civilization. Yeah, I saw what civilization and industrial advancement will get you in the war. Progress, well, it ain't always progress. Besides, I ain't lonely up here. I got company. Company, huh? Yes. Come look at these. Arthur caught that. Yep. Huh, did he? And he killed that with his hands. <laughs> Not his hands. That's quite something. Yeah, I got the whole of nature up here. And I'm going to make the most of it, as long as there still is some. <laughs> Whoa. They weren't lying. What's this? What's up? Right there by the outhouse. Look at the size of that boar. Good grief. Holy hell. I know. I That's a big goddamn thing. Day, but I didn't think it was possible. Let's go take care that, of it. That's a lot of bacon. Okay. Like, that's like a size of a damn bear. Holy shit. Stop. Blow it up, Molotov it, throw a knife at it, throw a tomahawk at it. Eh, let's go with our pistols. No, John, you got a dual wheel, my boy. Also, it might be an idea to get on our horse instead of chasing it on foot, but oh well. John needs to exercise. That's if I had my rifles. Then I had to dual wield some pistols. Come on, where are you? It's a big ass pig. How hard can it be to find? Oh. Eagle eyes. Oh yeah. Oh, sweet. Good thinking there, boy. Easy. I'm afraid I lost sight of him. Okay, first off. Don't worry. Tracks go this way. Come on. Let's see, what do we want? Carbine repeater, Lancaster repeater. Oh, yeah, I got a Litchfield repeater now. Springfield ooh, Springfield rifle, yes please. 
Oh, wait, no. It's not what I thought it was. Bolt action rifle. That's what we yeah, want. We'll get him. He came through here, all right. That's what we want. Here, piggy, piggy. Big shit. He's been across here twice. How does he know? Well, he's been up this hill to the right. And down this one in front of us. But I can't tell which tracks is... Let's split up. You go up, and I'll go onwards. Okay. Good luck to you, sir. Yeah. Come on, All right. you. Up we go. Let's go find us a pig. What are you hiding, piggy? What's that? Whoa, now. Investigate the wolf carcass. I'm gonna gore the shit out of it. Yeah, he did. <laughs> Poor thing. Horn wolves, too. Wonder if his name is Rhino. Oh! Damn it! Be a good girl now. Get our trusty rifle out. Go see what's what. Whoa! Easy now. Hamish. Shit, he's after him. All right, uh, uh, horsey, we gotta go. Rachel, we gotta go. I know there's like rocks and shit everywhere. <laughs> Come on, get, get, get over the rocks. Yoink. Okay. Where's he at? Jesus, no. Oh, shit. Got thrown and a bastard hog got me. Damn. Hey, take a bill for me, would you? And he's a good horse. He may be stubborn, <laughs> but he's strong. <laughs> oh, R.I.P. That guy. Hamish. Fucking pig. We got him, old man. I will take that trophy. I never did train that lion's paw now that I think about it. We gonna skin the hog? I got it, I got his Man, that is a big fucking pig. Holy fuck. God damn. I mean look at the, I mean his fucking head's bigger than John, like jeez Louise. All right, uh, what's your name, sir? All right, Buell. Good lad. All right, I guess he'll be our secondary horse. Come on, Buell. Let's go. Let's get out of here. There's a boy. Okay. Well, let's see where to head to next. Oh, yeah, I guess we can head up here. Oh, yeah, Charlotte. Okay, I was wondering who that was. So, actually, I got a story now that, I, now that I've got to this point um, about uh, Buell. Uh, it's actually, it's really sad. <laughs> it's actually very sad. Um, so, she did the whole thing with Arthur. Um, so, she got all of Hamish's stuff done while playing as Arthur. And she took Buell as her horse. And given what happened to Ludwig in my game, yeah, you can imagine it. It tore her the fuck up, and I was just like, "Oh man, that sucks." And then as soon as I got Buell here, I'm like, "Oh, okay, I can tell." Like, hey, I'm playing as John, and I got Buell, so Buell lives on in the great, you know, the, the greater scheme of things. If we're to treat my game as continuity and hers as like fan fiction or non-canon or whatever, but yeah, I, I, I feel I'm kind of glad we're kind of touching on these uh, people that we've met in the past. Um, I think it would have been better to do it as Arthur, but doing it as John, I guess it's a little bit better, because this is now John picking up. Hello. 
Easy boy. What the hell? What? Ah, damn it, mule. Okay. Hey, now. We're fine, ain't we? There, there. Easy. Okay. Let's go see what the fuck that was all about. Some dude howling in the night or some shit. I probably lost track of him. I think I know who that was, though. Yeah, he's supposed to be like a wild man or whatever that lives with wolves. I know he lives in a cave, I just don't know exactly where that cave is. I suppose I shall leave it be for now though, I'm sure we'll see him again. But yeah, he's like one of those random people you can encounter. Alright, anyways, uh, so yeah, I need to, you know, let her know, like, hey, I got Buell. <laughs> Actually, yeah, because I think I'll make Buell my main horse. I might consider to be doing that. Or I might be consider considering doing that. You know what I mean. That. <laughs> Alright, anywho. How close are we? Yeah, if we, yeah, if we cut across here, yeah, we should make it there in no time. No time at all. No time at all, I say. Who knows, we might run into that wolf guy again. Oh, shit. Hold, hold X down. Just hold it down. Run any trees. Okay. We made it. We made it. And it's raining like a bitch out here. You have entered legendary animal territory. Actually, it is a smart idea to have two horses while you're hunting. Because you can carry double the uh, carcasses. Of course, I guess at this point it's too late considering that uh, Pearson's uh, no longer with us. Okay. Looks a little breezy outside. Well, apparently she's over here. Or I just go knock on the door. Hello? What the hell did she go? Did she die? Damn. Oh yeah, I know that's penalizing me. I feel like she needs it. Oh, what the hell happened to her? And now I'm wondering if um, if I had visited her while playing as Arthur, she would have lived. Sure. Yeah, I probably should be looting from her. Okay, well, that was Sam and Cal and Charlotte. Zoom. Pro change view. That. Zoom. Flip. Read. Cal and Charlotte Blower, February 1883, Chicago. God damn, man. Like everybody, Arthur helps. Whoa, what the fuck was that? It's like everybody that Arthur helped is dying. Hamish is dead. Charlotte is dead. The Ginyus are dead. This whole thing's been one big disaster. Like j just like that dog shepherd said, except this time I don't have the Ginyus to bury the hole. Bury the hole. Bury it in the hole. Fuck! Actually, that's convenient because I mounted the wrong horse. Actually, wait, no one think about it. I, I, yeah, you know, I think I'll make Buell like kind of like a ranch horse. I'll make him the ranch horse. Alrighty. Um. Side bits. No. Um. 
Hmm. Base coach information, beat your toe. Actually, do they have... Ah, damn it. Map. I was going to see if I have any of those bounties available, because I might be able to do those. Uh, do, 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 do. All right, that's Emerald. Where's Valentine? Where's Valentino? There's Valentino. Uh, let's see. Nope. No bounties for me. Okay. But journal. No, I don't want to open up the journal. Oh, wait, hold on. Maybe I do. Um, close. Actually, that reminds me. I wonder. Uh, let's see. Show bank debts. Total owed 465. What the hell was that? Reed. Blackwater Virginia, a sweet young girl you met in an abandoned in the roadside. Mike and Outlaw. Oh. Okay, I might, I might give this a read at some point during the game. Just turn all the way, turn all the way, all the way. Okay, how many chapters are there? Page. Oh, never mind. I was thinking we could put up an entry of her in, in the thing, but I guess not. Okay. That's right, I keep forgetting that I need to mount this one. Let's see. Never mind. Okay. Oh, that's right. Uh, let's see. Log. Challenges. Asks. Henry Limix. Rob Watson's cabin. Oh, brother, catch up with Chrysus and Praetus at a later date. The dinosaur bones. Yeah, I found none of the dinosaur bones. Uh, house north of Rose, the word is there might be some Bibles inside. No lady lives alone north of Strawberries, rumored to be sitting on some valuables. Where's bottles shut off their heads to prove their bravery? Remotely controlled boat to a crowd of potential investors when buffoon and Saint Denise. Okay, I guess I have to go visit uh, Sadie. Hmm. Yeah, well, not really a whole hell of a lot to this. Actually, you know, I should. I should drop these horses off. It's just going to take me a while to get there. Like, holy shit. Uh, yeah, then I need to figure out how to make um, Abel, whatever the hell it is, uh, Buell? I think it's Buell. I need to figure out how to make him my secondary horse. So uh, I'm going to stop the recording here, and I shall see you all next time. All right, I have returned. I went ahead and stabled Buell, uh, mainly because... Um... Okay, make sure I had all my guns back. Uh, mainly because... Actually, hold up. Where if your link has your Springfield rifle? Okay, making sure I still had it. All right, so we're going to pay a visit to Sadie, because uh, that sounds just like Arthur. <laughs> what the hell, Fellas? sir? Good God! Good God. 
You know, there were two dudes like gunsling or not gunslinging, but uh, dueling. A real curly wolf. I told you to leave it, Bubba. I thought to myself, who this little girl thinks she's telling anything to? Uh, enjoy your drink in peace. <laughs> I ain't got no business with you right now. What that mean? For the last time, leave me alone. Or what? <laughs> <laughs> Looks just like that dude that uh, John and or Arthur and Lindy ran into. I'm Marston. It's good to see you. I, I thought I heard a rumor you was alive. Jim Milton, that you? Guess I didn't do it. Real good job of hiding my identity. Yeah. <laughs> we didn't hear nothing about you. You, you killed a feller up by Roanoke. Sure did. I thought that sounded like you. Or Abigail and Jack. She she's fine. She was always so kind to me. I'm looking to buy some property. Beecher's Hope, west of Blackwater. I'm kind of a farmer now. <laughs> mm -hmm. You? Oh, you know how it is. Bounties mostly and Oh, that is awesome. Good and bad. Fucking bounty hunter. You Hell yeah. Uh, I'm going I wouldn't mind a DLC you just playing as her hunting down people. Oh, that'd be fucking sweet. Oh. It's legal, I'm usually. Then, maybe. Come on then. All right, we'll what? do some bounty hunting. Where are we headed? Strawberry. Got on the run from New York. Good price for it. What do you do? Rob a bank. A gun? No, with a pen. With a pen. Ah. It's easy. Watch out! Watch out! All right, you'll follow Sadie. Your telegram. You said you had something to discuss. I didn't think we'd be chasing down an outlaw. There's something else. Oh. What? Oh. I think so. I heard of someone sounded like him but about a year back. Okay. We always said if we found him. I know what we said we'd do. That ain't changed. I didn't think I'd Oh, I see where this is going now. You left for the Yukon? Now we came back. Didn't strike it rich, as you can see. But you're a rancher now. I got Uncle with me. We'll be okay. Uncle? Well, getting a scout by that gang out there might be preferable than living with him. <laughs> Sometimes I think the same. Yeah, I wonder if we'll run into anyone else. I mean, we've run into Sadie and Uncle so far. Be nice to run into Tilly. Karen and uh, Mary Beth as well. Otherwise, I think we'll just get like an epilogue thing. I believe the original Red Dead Redemption has that. But Sadie is a bounty hunter. Holy shit. <laughs> That's fucking awesome. Outlaws took away everything from her and then in some ways they gave back to her. And now she's doing right again. Like she's living a straight life. That's fucking awesome. Welcome to Strawberry. Oh, what is my back today? Probably should stretch when you wake up. I guess I can take it off cinematic mode. All right, see what you can find. All right. Like I said, feller's name is Nathan Kirk, banker, bald, forty-five. Okay. You hit him that way. Captain Cook. Let's go find Captain Cook. He's apparently stooped to banker or thievery. Bank fraud? Yeah, fraud. That's that's it. Fraud. Dramatic it! Never mind. Hello? Nobody here? Oh, hi. Yes, you. You there. Good sir. Threaten. Question. Excuse me, friend. I'm looking for a Nathan Kirk, fellow from New York. You got any mail for him? Kirk? Kirk. No. Is that that one dude that asked you to I escort him, but I ended up scaring him off? Curly, I think. Well, she's a woman. <laughs> Curly. Ask in the welcome center. Most tourists check in there. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, good sir. All right. Oh, that was easy. I already got a lead. Oh, I stepped in horse shit. Oh, my boots. My clean boots. The dirty. And dramatic entrance. 
Hello. You uh, you seen a fella, a fella from New York, bald guy? Yeah, a few New Yorkers come here in search of the West. This one's a wanted man. I work for the government. Uh, sort of. <laughs> he's like, oh, really? His name's Nathan Kirk. Mr. Kirk, but he's so charming. Is he staying here? He's uh. Up in room three. All right. I'm gonna go pay him a visit. It's government business. <laughs> How exciting. <laughs> he just does not give a shit. <laughs> it's like, whatever. Just don't mess up the place. Mm. I clean it daily, and I want to keep it all nice and spruce. All right, so let's see. That's room two. That's room Mr. three. Mr. Kirk, you in there? Who is it? It's just a friend. Just a friend. Come on, open the door. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. Stop. Get back here, you. That's Nathan Kirk. I think it is like, oh. Got him. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Come on, jump out. Oh, <laughs> nice. Remember, we <laughs> I mean, I think for all intents and purposes, should not have made that. I think that is the guy that, um... I want to say that is the guy that you escorted down here. Oh, I thought he fell down. I was like, damn. Come here, you bastard. Yeah. Oh, man, this fool's, this fool's got some balls. He's off-roading it. You got some balls, Baldy. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I didn't do it. I was innocent. I swear as an officer's. They're in pursuit of the suspect. It's going down I-95 on horseback. Monsters. 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 Oh, shit. The part of sheepies. Oh, we're starting to tire. You know what that means? Uh, where's it at? Oh, horse. There we go. Horse stimulant. Look at you. Come on, talk to us. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I don't do it. What are you fart knocker? Come on, my juiced horse. Got you now, Biatch! Oh, oh wait, maybe it isn't him. Never mind. I can't tell. <laughs> Thanks for that, Mr. Kirk. Real fun. I'm an innocent man! Wait, no, no, no. It's all a mistake. My wife... My wife is a, is a desperate... No, no, no. Drop him, drop him. How are you buried, sir? None of your business what I am. Pat him down. She broke me. He didn't have I did bad. Hair pomade. <laughs> there is a difference. I can't tell if that's the right dude or not. You've got no right to do this. Where shall I send the money? I ain't been paid yet. Send it on my behalf to West Elizabeth Cooperative Bank in Blackwater. Pay down my loans. Might make him happy to see I've got a boss. So I've got a couple of other leads I could use your help with if you're interested. I'm I am very interested. The saloon in Blackwater. I need money pretty bad, so I'll come find you. All right. We got to meet with Sadie. We got to do some bounty hunting. And unfortunately, I can't rename this horse, so Rachel Ray it is. At least she's a good cook. I need to eat something after this video. Okay. Uncle has some. Ooh, bounty poster. Yeah. Yeah, let's go do some bounty hunting. Why not? Actually, first, see if I can get into my. Oh, sure, yeah, I'll feed you. Why not? Got an appetite. <laughs> Got quite the appetite, buddy. Study you. Study you carefully. Um, brush, roof, saddle. Ah, here we go. Horse cargo. 
grind. Uh, let's see, horse, flat cap, John's classic hat, Arthur's hat. Outfits, the cowboy, custom outfits. John's, yeah, it is, okay. Now I look like a proper bounty hunter. A very proper bounty hunter. Okay, so yeah, I, I, alright, so I'm assuming this is going to lead to us eventually hunting down Micah. It's going to be fun. But yeah, like, DLC where you get to play, see, like, in between, you know, where it's like, she runs off with, uh, Abigail and, oh, shit. Or she runs off with Abigail and all of them. And then, like, starts life as a bounty hunter and you just kind of relive, or not relive, but you get to live through her experiences up until she gets that lead on Micah. And have it end with her finding out that John's alive and be like, eh, I'm gonna go look for John. I think that'd be cool. And maybe that's where you'll find out what happened to, like, Tilly and all them. That'd be my guess anyways. Out of the damn way! <laughs> out of the damn way! But yeah. I wonder if I wonder what Dutch is up to then. It makes me wonder. Oh. Okay, girl. Shit. That's a girl. Nope, put your gun away. Put your gun away. We don't want to shoot up strawberry. We don't want to pull a mica. Start shooting the place up. Does this place have a gun store? Because I believe I need some ammo for my Springfield. Uh, let's see, general store, hotel, bounty poster, FFF guts. Oh, guts. Okay, guts. What the hell is that? Okay. Could be worse out. All right, general store it is. Oh, uh, Mr. General Store, dramatic entrance. Jesus. How do you do that, sir? Um. Hi. Can I not purchase things? Pocket watch. And features. Where's your ammo at? You're not so ammo, sir. Hmm. Guessing not. Yeah, you... Why can't I just use your goddamn? Do I have my mask on? No. Actually, if I did have my mask on, you would have said something. Alright, well, whatever. Fuck it. We'll just hold off, I guess. Waste of my goddamn time. Excuse me. No damage done. None at all. Okay, no dramatic entrance here. This is the police. We don't want to piss them off. You ain't a tourist, so I'm guessing you're a bounty hunter. Posters usually go up on that wall there. Wall over here, eh? Or oh, here we got. Mm. Inspect bounty poster. Go be hunting. Joshua Brown. Well, well. Let's see. The notorious shooter is one for killing unlawful killings. For unlawful killings, Brown is a medium bill, dark skin, long mustache, less than whereabouts with North Strawberry. Forty dollars. Okay, so we gotta bring him in alive. He's made a home out of an old mine. Up in the Big Valley Mountains. But you might want to leave that one on the wall. Happy hunting. Alright, thank you, sir. Officer. Alright, let's go hunt. Oh. <laughs> no! Get, get off of it! <laughs> I'm Why? <laughs> get off of him, you idiot. Uh. Oh, damn it! No, sir! It was all a misunderstanding! I'm out of here. Wait, hold on, this isn't my work. <laughs> okay! Okay! Okay, god damn it, this is just turning into a disaster! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I'm bit of both, apparently! <laughs> 
<laughs> fucking scared that dude. <laughs> uh, oh, that was funny. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> All right, let's see where we can find whether this is North of Strawberry. Uh, let's see. Bounty hunting. Wink. Okay, I might want to go around that red line. Yeah, I'm probably going to have a bounty. <laughs> Ironically, I'm going to have a bounty on myself. Okay. <laughs> just ran and spit that dude. <laughs> He's just mind his own business reading the newspaper. What do I do? Fucking gore his ass. <laughs> I run that one. I steal a horse, run over somebody with it. Oh, that was funny. That was very funny. Well, seventeen dollars and fifty cents. Shit. Hopefully this. Oh yeah, this bounty's worth forty dollars, so I can pay for it. Shit. God. Damn it! Ah, you all right there, Rachel? Be a good girl now. <laughs> be a good girl now. <laughs> Boss, you just tried to kill us. Boss, why, why are you telling me to be a good girl? You tried to kill me, bastard. Anyways. Oh man. <laughs> bounty already comes in, accepts the bounty, proceeds to assault citizens. John, what was going through your head? I don't know. I just felt this sudden urge to just spear the shit out of the guy. And it didn't feel right the first time, so I figured I'd give it a second shot. You know, at least we didn't kill the fool. That would have been much worse. Easy. Easy. He's way up in the mountains. Speaking of which, let's try not to fall off said mountains. I said let's try not to fall off said mountains, you silly animal. This might even be a case of better to travel by foot than horse. Maybe that was the guy's thinking. They wouldn't pursue him on horse. Oh, never mind. That's opened up quite a bit now. Oh yeah, I forgot. I need to get my hat back. John's classic hat. Easy there. Yeah, I'm gonna save Arthur's hat for the special occasion. That'll be the occasion of hunting down Micah. I suppose it also helps that we have uh, Arthur's guns. Oh, that's gonna make it even more poetic. Kill him wearing his hat with his guns. Oh. I'm just gonna cut across here. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Okay. Whew. Like, don't get knocked off. Are we getting close, Fraytel? Oh, yeah, we're, like, right there. Hey, hey, easy! Our last one at the ready. I gotta take this fool alive. At least I think I do, because it says the apprehension. Knock, knock, bitches. You in here? He's unavailable due to your recent crimes. Turn at a later date. Shit. Ugh, you fucking... Oh, my... I make it all the way up here. Just be told... Nope, sorry. Can't. Okay, missy. Go. Really? Really? Yeesh. Okay, let's just run far enough away that it resets itself or whatever. If I have to pay off my bounty, I'll just pause the recording and do that off screen. Calm down. The predators. Okay, girl. 
spread it all over the damn place. Shit. Okay, yeah, it's still unavailable. Son of a bitch. Okay, well, let's go pay off my bounty, I guess. It's not too far of a ride. Eh. Need to be able to splice this out. The hell was that? Uh, uh, John, I'd like to see what the hell it is pursuing us. Got it. Okay, now I saw a dude up here. Who apparently vanished. Oh, hello, what do we got going on up here? Please don't delay me any further. Yes, you I'm just a homestead. I'm looking for a... I'm here. Put that down. We just talking to this homestead. Oh. I did the right thing there, right? Where you at? Okay. I guess we did a good deed, question mark. Don't know if I did a good deed. Oh, I mean, those guys were clearly robbing the dude, so I assume I did. I assume I did the right thing. Made amends for my bad ways and whatnot. I'm still kind of annoyed. I mean, it's funny as it was that I, you know, did what I did accidentally. Um, kind of annoyed that it also means I have to travel back to Strawberry, back to the Bounty, and then back to Strawberry again. Yep. I'll probably do another splicing video. I mean, I, I, I think it makes it more convenient for both me and you guys. Because that way I don't have the cut footage. I can just merge everything together. Kind of recording pieces and then just combining them together. My only fear is that the quality won't be as good, but I don't know. I'll have to take a gander to see how uh, one of my other videos turns out. Alright, so I'll get in here, pay off my bounty, and then. Not before I kill that poor rabbit. Go that Wesky Wabbit. Oh, now it's 17. Fun. Okay. Yeesh. Alright, let's get in here. Pay, pay, cut, slow the goddamn hell. Bastard. I'm just here to pay my bounty, sir. I'm not here to cause any more trouble. Okay. Rachel Ray, behave yourself. Dramatic entrance. Kind of. Hello. Hey there. You Hector? That's me. I've been told you're a discouraged man. Oh. Ah, you must be ah. a friend of that Josiah Trelawney. Mm. All right. In that case, I've got something here you might want to take a look at. Mm. Oh, really? <laughs> okay. Uh, go try to tip for two dollars. Sure. Rob some people, make some money, and pay off our debt. Everybody wins. There's a stage heading up from water. Okay. Well, I hear it'll be heavily guarded, so you might want to try a more covert approach. Or lay down some explosives. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> You're the expert. Eh, guns blazing tends All to work. Right, Hector. Appreciate it. You enjoy the rest of your day. All right, suit yourself. Okay, I, I can. Can we pay off our debts? This is not the place to pay off the debts. Where do I pay off my debts? That's a newspaper. That's a general store. That's the hotel. Stagecoach. Okay, we'll just leave, and we'll re-enter. 
Reset him. God, come on, really? Fuck <sighs> a duck. Alright, I will see you all in a bit. <laughs>